Hey guys, this is Blue Eddy Support, a knowledge base to help you have a better experience with Blue Eddy. And today, we're focusing on how to build a split phase system with EP500. Here we need two EP500 units and a P030A fusion box. And you can buy all these from our website. P030A fusion box can integrate two EP500s into one power system to double the available output power, voltage, and capacity. It has one 200 to 240 volt 30 amp L14-30 socket, two 100 to 120 volt 30 amp TT30 sockets, and four 100 to 120 volt 20 amp sockets. It also comes with a communication cable. Use this communication cable to connect two EP500 units together. Plug in and twist to lock firmly. Now we connect P030A fusion box with two EP500 units. Please note here, disconnect the AC charging cable when connecting and make sure L1, L2, and N are in the correct order. Set both EP500s to split phase mode. Tap the settings, next, and change the single phase to split phase. Choose this one as the master unit. Repeat the above steps to set the other and make it the slave unit. Here's a hint that two masters or two slaves are not feasible. Activate the system by enabling the AC output on the master unit. The LED indicators light up when we complete the system successfully. Let's test it with a dryer. If you want to charge the system, an AC input cable with an L14-30 connector is required. Plug the cable into the AC input ports and twist to lock. Connect the end with an aviation head to the wall outlet. Now we have a split phase system to run all your high voltage appliances. That's all for today. Please follow us for more videos and let me know if you have any questions or ideas. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.